Hey there friends, it's Paul and welcome to another video and today we've got an unboxing of some new reboot Bakugan. So first up we've got this Geogun which is called Surturan I think and then uh, next up we also got this fusion Bakugan called Hydorus and Trino Ultra. I got these recently at a toy store and I decided to also make an unboxing of these Bakugan. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this unboxing. <laughs> Okay, so first up, we're gonna open Surgeron. So as we know, this is a Geogon. Here we have him inside his packaging. And he's looking pretty cool. And also the box art looks quite amazing. As usual, here at the back, we can see that this Bakugan has two ability cards and a gate card. So yeah, let's get it open. And I don't know why, but it still feels quite weird to open these Bakugan after so long. You know, from new Bakugan from their packaging, but it feels weird but also amazing. I'm pretty hyped to do it. So here, let's let's get it open. Let's get this Bakugan out. Okay, let's put this to the side. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we can see our little Bakugan Geogon. So first up, let's take the pack of cards out. Let me use my scissors. Okay. So yeah, here we got our... Okay, it's a bit stuck. <laughs> Come on. And there we go. So yeah, here we got our pack with uh, the gate card and the ability cards. And then we got our Bakugan. Let's use our scissors to remove this plastic thingy that holds him inside and yeah now let's remove him out of this plastic case thing <laughs> okay he's a bit stuck come on, come on. okay there we got him and i think he <laughs> he's a bit close right now but he's looking quite nice so far pretty cool pretty cool so but first let's let's um let's put him to the side for a sec let's open the card pack Use once again this my scissors. Okay. So let's check out what we've got inside. Once again, here we can see first of all we've got the manual, you know, on how to play this new version of Bakugan. Uh, to be honest, I still haven't taken a look at the manuals, but I will soon to learn how to play this new version of Bakugan. Then next up we've got the little chart I guess with the Bakugan of this wave of Geogon rising. So first up we've got the Ultra Bakugan from and from what I've read these are like bigger more detailed Bakugan. Then we've got the Geogons which have their weird shapes and then the conventional Bakugan I guess. And here it's pretty cool but here uh, we got the different attributes you know the different colors all that good stuff. I'll, I'll still need to learn the you know how each of these new symbols look. And next up, here we got the, I guess, character card of this Bakugan, this Geogun, Surgeron. He looks pretty awesome, pretty menacing. Okay, from what I see, I think he's a type of, like, demon-like Bakugan creature. Uh, he's looking pretty badass. I still do not know what these the symbols below mean, but I'll soon know. <laughs> then we've got another, I guess, his ability card, Fire Floor. Once again, here we've got Surturan doing a pretty epic pose here, <laughs> looking quite badass. Um, yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice. And next up we've got uh, the gate card. It, something quite interesting is here, you can see below like that, minus 300. So I'm guessing some gate cards actually reduce the power of certain Bakugan based on their attribute, which is a cool addition. So let's open him up now, correctly. <clears throat> and yeah, it, I mean, Surturn looks pretty nice uh, from what I saw, like, you know, when I was looking at the packaging at the toy store, I figured that this Bakugan was, was going to be like a demon-like Bakugan creature thingy. And once again, here, a pretty nice detail here is that that mix of, you know, solid plastic and the translucent one. It's quite an awesome color combination. And here, what I didn't notice on the last unboxing video is that these Geogun actually have power, like, not like um, Tribe of Bakugans that didn't actually have a G power, but these uh, Geoguns actually do. Which is interesting, very interesting. So here, let's try and closing him up. Uh, I think, yeah, it's pretty easy, thankfully. Okay, let's get it to click in and click in. Yep, okay. So yeah, from what we can see here, this Bakugan is a type of cylinder, I guess. 
and it's looking quite nice close I also like you know like similar to uh, Crab Baku and I really love that these Geogun also have weird shapes when they're closed it's something really interesting that I really love the Crab Bakugan now with these Geogun so let's try and get this Bakugan to roll into the gate card okay let's see if we can do it then yeah <laughs> first attempt <laughs> nice <clears throat> so yeah <clears throat> here we got these his two little feet which are the only manual parts of this Bakugan something I also really like of these new reboot Bakugan is that mostly all of them like most of their parts open automatically when you know that when they touch the magnet which is pretty awesome like you don't really need to open them that much with your own hands which is a nice change and yeah I'm liking the the color combo again uh, well, of course this is a Pyrus Bakugan and yeah he's looking very very nice pretty nice addition to that collection <laughs> Here we've got our Hydorus and Trino Ultra Bakugan Fusion. I don't know if these Bakugan are called like Fusion Bakugan or whatever, but I call them like that. Um, so here we can see him in his packaging, then the creature, the box art of this creature. It's a bit scratched off. In the back we can see that he also has his character card, uh, ability card, and the gate card in the two Baku cores. So let's get him open. And here just like a little heads up. I apologize if you hear some weird sounds in the background, but I live like right behind a park and right now they're doing some like restoration work on this tennis court. So they're like drilling today and using hammers to I guess take out like the floor or something to it. So if, if it's a bit loud, I'm sorry about that. I tried to get my room as quiet as possible. So yeah, sorry there is a bit of weird sounds on the background. So here we've got these Baku cores and this green one is a new one for me. I've never had one of these. I still do not know what it does. But eventually I'll learn this new version of the game so I'll know what they do. Uh, okay, let's clean this off a bit. And here we've got our Bakugan. And let's take him out of the packaging. Okay. Okay. Nope, okay, I think he's a bit stuck in there. Come on. Okay, I'm kind of scared to pull him out because I don't want to break him. Okay, come on. Okay, there we go. There we go. So, from my first looks looking at the creature art in the box and stuff, my guess is that the two individual Bakugan that make this Bakugan are, I guess one is a lion? And the other one seems to be a type of like rhinoceros or triceratops. But the combo looks pretty awesome from what I'm seeing also here. I think this is a fusion of a Pyrus and Aurelis Bakugan. I'm guessing this because of the you know red plastic and then the golden details. Like I still do not know the symbols but I'm guessing that's the combo of these two Bakugans. And yeah the Bakugan's looking really really great like pretty awesome. So let's put him to the side for a second. So here once again, let's look at these Baku cores. I still do not know what they do, but I'll soon learn about them. Okay, let's open up the card pack. Once again, using our scissors. Okay. Okay, let's move this to the side. And once again, we've got another, uh, you know, instruction manual. I don't know if, like I said before, I don't know if, you know, as the seasons progress, the way the game's display changed but I'll read the different manuals I've got to actually learn how to play this version of this new reboot Bakugan next up okay here we got again the pretty useful and awesome instructions on how to actually close the Bakugan as I said before I think this is a pretty awesome addition to Bakugans because back in the day we actually didn't know how to close them properly so we kind of had to learn on the spot uh, okay, so here we got our checklist uh, list of Bakugan of this wave and Yeah, I mean there are many awesome designs of these new Bakugan and hopefully I can get more in the future and Here I here we can see I guess the different combination of attributes that can, are possible in this game and Yep Pretty cool <laughs> 
Okay, as the gate card. Oh, okay, here we got another one. Like in the last video, we also got this gate card. And I mean, the arts of these new gate cards are pretty awesome. I like how the, you know, the art covers the entirety of the entire card. Like back in the day, the classic cards used to have a weird frame. But I like this version where the entire art is covered, covers the entire uh, card. <laughs> then we've got this uh, ability card here. I think I think that's Drago in the, in the art of this ability card. I still do not know that what the symbols do, but I'll soon learn about them. So bear with me. And I'm sorry. <laughs> That I don't know about them uh, but yeah the, the art looks pretty awesome <laughs> and then we've got the character card oh, okay so here Hydora I guess is the, the lion and then Trino looks like a Triceratops yeah I'm guessing it's a Triceratops they look pretty badass together <laughs> so yeah now Aurelis Empire's Bakugan and here we've got their combination and damn I, wow I mean the, these like uh, card arts or art in the cards looks really awesome i'm really enjoying them like they're pretty aesthetic okay after looking at the manual for a second uh i learned how to close this bakugan because i was struggling a bit so first we gotta close the back legs then put them together with the front ones then flip the little front paws in then push the head down then we grab the tail and boom it all clicks in and here this like collar combo once the Bakugan is closed in his ball form looks really nice. I don't know why but for some reason it reminds me of Iron Man because of course you've got the main red plastic then you've got the golden details and then the silver ones. So yeah for some reason it reminds me of Iron Man which is nice <laughs> I'm guessing. And yeah, I really enjoy the colors of these new uh, Reboot Bakugan. The color combos are pretty nice, pretty unique, you know, makes them look special, badass. And you know me, I like my Bakugan to be really colorful. So that's a plus on my books. So now let's try and get this Bakugan open by placing him on the gate card. So, okay, let's try it out. And, okay, <laughs> we fail. Okay, let's give it another shot. And boom, okay, we got him open. And once again, like the previous reboot Bakugan, this one also opens from its leg, from its leg, from his tail. Um, it's pretty weird, but quite interesting to see this because you know back in the day we got we're used to Bakugan opening from the bottom where the magnets used to be but it's pretty nice I guess it's uh it has to work like that based on the fact that these now use those Baku cores but yeah it's cool <laughs> the Bakugan look really funny when they open <laughs> and they like flip over <laughs> And yep, I mean this Bakugan looks really nice. Like again, I really like how like basically all parts of this Bakugan open on their own. Like there's not much need for you to open certain parts manually, which is a plus. And is a uh, interesting and better feature I, from these new reboot Bakugan. And yeah, I'm really loving this new Bakugan I've got. So yeah my friends, this has been my new unboxing video of Surturan and Hydoras and Trino Ultra Fusion. Hope you enjoyed the video. And yeah, I mean, I'll try and continue to buy new Bakugan and do these unboxings, you know, do this type of live commentary thingy, because I think you, you'll enjoy them. And yeah, I mean, if you like the video, don't forget to drop a like, leave in the comments which of these Bakugan is your favorite. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel as I post videos every Monday and Friday. As always, thanks for all the support you give to this channel. And yep, it's been Paul and I'll see you in the next video.